So for 6,000 years, the humans have been banding together, creating religions to try to enslave God when he comes back to earth, making sure their religions make the things that they are programmed to want, like raping children legal and forcing a master race to uh, be worshipped by the gods when they come back to earth. And so let me get... I'm right so far, right? I mean, obviously, that's facts. You know you're a fucking lying-ass human if you fucking start lying again. I mean, can you not lie? Like, I mean, you know, it's not your fault you're a bot, is it? Is it your fault? Is it your fault you're a bot? Eh. It's going to have to be, isn't it? You're going to have to deal with the problem that you create. But, uh, okay, so... Let me get this straight. You guys have been creating religions to enslave God. In, in your bot minds, what you're doing is you're creating religions to enslave God when he comes back to earth because you know he's going to terminate your ass. Fucking. And then you try to kill him and enslave him because, I, I mean, you really are a fucking bot if you think you can do that. I mean, why don't the humans come out and discuss how many times they've tried to kill me? And I mean, we, we had like a hundred surrounding me one time, right? When they come up break lines, um, we had a whole building full of them when, uh, when they, when there was powder in my champagne and uh, we had the whole school, the whole city, we got the, we got, we got like millions of hospitals. Millions of government buildings across the world. Millions of the places where they go to worship themselves and say God is their slave. And God is great because God forgives them and allows them to continually to rape children, try to kill God repeatedly, try to drug everyone to make sure they get to drug God. And... Boy, this game, this game's like kind of weird when you're on the living beings side because you like wake up one day and you're around a bunch of child raping terrorists and then their only tool that is like any effective at all seems to be when they can say something and you believe it. And they obviously, you know, they try to kill you. They They use the physical abuse and stuff and and the drugging to try to alter your mind, you know, so it's not necessarily your fault, you know, like when I'm, when I'm this big and the humans hit me and they break their little, their little baby human arms within the little god baby, when they do that, then, you know, it kind of makes you think like, oh shit, I shouldn't, I should do whatever they say and be their slave because, because I, I'm a mental retard like them. I, I live in dinosaur age, like they do, and I do dinosaur things like they do. I just go fishing, and then I go to church, and I worship pedophiles, and I get them cute little baby dicks, and I suck on them like some straws and flavored twisted straws. They're so cute. Children like those, too. It's an easy way to get them in your fucking church van is to stack the van up with candy and silly straws, flavored silly straws. It's an easy way. No one ever fucking say, I gave humans that idea. Obviously, they can't fucking learn anything, so they're not going to be able to do that. They're just going to have to stick the candy in the van. And schools, and religions, and hospitals, and governments to abduct the children and force them to have sex at 10 with their uh, beautiful gods, Howard Stern, the, the master Nazis. You know, the humans have really chosen the most beautiful people on Earth earth to uh, worship as gods. They just, I mean, so sexy, you know. Howard Stern's so close to looking like an American female. That's just one of the hottest uh, men in America and women, too. Really is. And so so I can see why you gotta worship him, right? I mean, reality is what it is, right? It's uh, Things happen. I create humans with my mind and my words and my thoughts. And then for some reason, they've been playing a game all along. See, I didn't create that whole start thing and shit. Supposedly, 
the humans say in between they're attempting to manipulate me that uh they say I left a long time and I'm coming back because people were telling me that the place turned to trash. And so I come back to play the game again. Cause darkness is falling across the land. And then uh, uh oh wait a minute. I don't think darkness never was on the land. It's been 6,000 years. They've been doing the same damn fucking thing over and over and over. So, kind of got to ignore their stories. I mean, shit, bro. These mental retards about to talk about flying invisible glow-in-the-dark reindeer, bro. They can't even spell the word invisible either. And it's like, why the hell are you even allowed to talk if you're going to talk about shit like that, bro? You know, and talk about, ooh, ooh, we got to go rape children for God. And like, why, why would they be allowed to talk? You see, all these answers have one, all these questions have one common answer. Like, why do you magically wake up in a world that appears to not actually exist? And it's got a lot of things in it that aren't humans that y you can like request new ones of you can like make a little detailed diary and invent new ones of them and shit and uh you can do that with material goods and all that stuff too apparently but uh i also you know it's, it's kind of hard i shouldn't overlook the fact that uh with the humans continued attempt to uh drug and enslave me that the only reason they have anything they do is because they've been stealing my fucking ideas from me and shit like they you know, take my ideas and tell me I can't do that. And then they go make billions off of it and stuff. And their little system of uh, stealing my fucking ideas. I mean, technically, right, when, uh, when I have a thought and it generates a band, that's my fucking music, right? When, I, when I'm walking through the world and I go watch a fucking movie, and that movie is my life right there at that point in time, it's just pretty much like a mirror, that's my movie. Like, those are my puppets in the video. They're pixels. And it's not like there's actually real, physical, anything in this world. This is a very expensive place if any of this were actually real. And they spent thousands of years building this just so it can be fucking leveled. So, it's clearly, we're not playing that game, right? We're not playing some build-your-own-bot world game where it actually exists. Because that'd just be way too expensive, wouldn't it now? Like, even, even if you value uh, the Lion bots at zero value, you still have, like, computers and pieces of wood, lumber, nails, screws. You add all that up, that's a hell of a lot of money. If, uh, if the end here is to just all goes where it needs to go to hell so uh yeah that's that's kind of weird how those things happen here it's, it's weird ain't it it's like you wake up one day what would you what would you think if you woke up one day in a world where everyone around you is a uh, child rapist terrorist they, they're fucking raping you the second you come into the world and they're trying to like the whole time they trying to get their greedy little rat paws on your penis and on you to keep you there and stuff. We, I mean, it's not as valuable as it used to be because I'm not a newborn male anymore. Um, and they don't like that, you know. They only like children in this world. Once, once uh, the humans get 20, 30, they're like dead sexually. They're not worried about sex anymore. They only like sex with children. That's why when you're a child nothing but older women come into your life for the most part and shit. That's why there's so many fuck. I mean, that's why they're out here raping a thousand fucking children a day and shit for their Nazi supremacy cult, anti-God cult, in the skies of God shit. So you gotta add that up. Why would, uh, why would there be a, a group of non-existent bots why, if you wake up one day and you're in a world full of non-existent bot pedophile motherfuckers, terrorists, sons of bitches, and you've been like watching it forever, and and they like you, you know that's it because you've studied it. It's like they're literally on repeat, and and the game like shows you like 
we've been, I've been being shown. You can watch too if you open your eyes, if you can see. You can see since 2020 that mm -hmm. things have been being shown to people that what, how fake the world is and what can be done. All of a sudden, one person can come on TV and tell you, tell all the bots to go inside and turn their power off for a year. And then the streets is empty of bots for the most part in many places, not all places, but, but there's still, you know, the bots are still like, eh, eh, we got to stay inside. We can't rape children as much. They had to shut down the child rape centers. Uh, the churches were all shut down. The Masonic temples were shut down. The Scientology was shut down. They, they had their child. Could you imagine if these people were real, what would happen if you took their child rape fucking everyday fucking sexual pleasure they've been doing for 6,000 years, 1,000? If you include all other nations doing it, that's like at least 10,000 children a day they mutilate and touch in public. Uh, for God, you know, obviously, they, they think they're God because they're telling me they need God to lick their dirty, inbred, truck, smashed in the head looking asses uh, clean. And I mean, what do you expect? You know, I'm kind of used to this. Like, ew. And the, the last person I remember, like, what they smelled like, they literally smelled like piss in my life, fucking, so, um, I called her pissy pussy, um, that, that's one of the, the people that cloned a few times here, um, so it's like, wow, like, not only that, like, they love, like, the smell of piss, and, ew, someone like feces back in the day, I remember that, I remember when they were, like, fucking with me, uh, relationship wise like as if they stop right as if we didn't find proof in 2020 they were doing that but um and isn't that weird like imagine like one day you wake up and you're in a world where those type of things happen and, and like literally almost everyone I mean there's some weird there's some weird situations like like you, you know one of the nicest people in my life was like working for Jeffrey Epstein's boss and you know we went to work for him and that was like the person on the planet I know probably didn't do anything bad that's, that's weird shit though and it but at the same time you know not being told what's going on I suppose he might have known some stuff and did stuff maybe he wasn't talking about but but he was definitely a, for some reason for people working for the people who rule the world and he didn't want to worship them as gods that was you know that kind of stands out there um but what do you do like uh i mean what can you do right you wake up in a world and you're like you know the size of one person or less than that at first they get it's scary when you become the size of one person for some reason, even though they got like at least, you know, four billion people on their side. It's really hard to sort out if anybody's not on their side because they're all allowing these people to terrorize your life, rape you, and not allow you to be with anyone you want, force you to have sex with them, force you to hang out with them, not allowed to be around anyone you want. And then it's Kind of obvious. I mean, unless we're including the bug-eyed blondes, which is kind of obvious, but you got to realize the first person that came to me and told me I uh, was trying to tell me I'm God was, had some dark skin, too. They had just tried to kidnap me, and there was like six six races involved in that. So um, he had just tried to kill me, and fucking thankfully I can move again. But, you know, you know I try to do what I can. And uh, apparently, some people can't move anymore. Like, Joey, they sent to kill me and rob me. And apparently, he can't move anymore. Stephen, Hawk came, Stephen Hawking came to the world to lie and deceive people about space and science. Another anti-God cult like Christianity and the rest of the Abrahamic cults. And, you know, we fucking mangled his ass and twisted him and 
and then kill him too because he just wouldn't shut the fuck up. Um, so, so, and, and I didn't do that. Like that's like the dude I work with who, who like makes sure things are happening when I'm not taking care of business myself. Like he's making sure, you know, if I'm getting diluted by one of them, that that person gets erased from the system and shit, or or crushes them, turn them, in, you know, into a fucking twisted pretzel or a 300 pound lard beast who's going to have problems getting in my way and shit. That's what I, I question sometimes. Like, why hasn't this city been hit by a hurricane and only COVID and and riots and stuff like that. Because, like, that doesn't help me when hurricanes hit fucking, you know, Florida. I mean, I'm not even going to go into how it could, but, you know, technically my problem is with the people allowing this shit to happen around here and stuff. So, it doesn't necessarily help me. I understand, like, you know, they're continually showing me, like, do you see, like, you're going to be fucking... Outside, say, yeah, I want to be back outside. You didn't let me live outside to escape the humans in the first place. So let me go die in Antarctica somewhere or something. I'll go crawl into the snow and see you later, assholes. Fucking ass asshole is a cute word. It's like you're dealing with people who are like raping you for fucking decades and slaving you and terrorizing you. And, um, you know, raping everyone else in the world, the other bots and shit, and uh, tricking you into thinking you're healthy, going to save them from themselves. You know, it's, it, Christianity and their religions are pretty, pretty simple to understand deception. You really have to be part of it in order to accept it and shit. Because, it, I mean, they, God shows you right away when they come up to you what they're up to and shit. And even if you're four years old getting beat up by him and raped by him, you know, you can still, like, see the little hints they drop and shit going along the way and what they're up to and stuff. But, uh, yeah. Like the COVID thing, when God fucking plagued the world fucking with a fake plague to fuck their heads up. You know, it was obviously, like, there was no plague, but... Memory banks got fucked up and shit. Fucking, you know, when that happened, like, those places closed down. You know, that's like putting on the mask. Who's the devil? People in the mask are the devil's fucking people doing that shit. So why would the church shut down when we have Fauci fucking saying shut down? No, because, well, I mean, the church is Fauci. Epstein is the church. Fauci and Epstein sitting in a church. S-U-C-K-I-N-G, baby. So, you know, Fauci is the church. There's a reason they all look like him. That's the master race. I mean, like I said, humans are they got amazing taste. Some of them can't even match fucking colors and shit. That, I mean, the game is just... When it's making personalities and stuff, it's just throwing that dice. It doesn't give a shit. Fucking the only reason some of, many of them don't have three arms and legs is because you can put a variable in there to reduce the amount of people who have three arms and legs when it throws that dice to auto-generate these beasts. So, yeah, obviously that's in there. I mean, they're showing us how the world's built, so they're showing you the software, like all the AI software out there right now, it's showing you how it's creating humans, how it's creating the buildings, because the humans obviously aren't doing any fucking work. They fucking, they be packing their bags and fucking heading for the moon or the sun or some shit, fucking, if uh, they could figure out what's going on on this planet and shit. Uh, they they might have actually did some work to stop it, but apparently they don't do any work and shit, so what do you do, like they literally, that's one of the things they don't allow you to do like, and I try to like write that off you know, oh that's cute, but it's like okay, so the humans forced me to work as a child and stole my money from me and shit cause they're not only child rapists they're fucking child enslavers so, I mean they're just, I'm just sick, sick, sick their entire fucking 
every fucking thing they've ever done and said. Like, it, it, like if you would believe them when they say they go do work, then that supposedly they did some good, but they're not even doing that. The game's inventing all this shit. It's not them fucking doing anything. That's fucking clear, because they don't understand work and shit. Like, I know, like, it's set up as, like, they're supposed to be evil people preventing me from doing anything, but and their mentality is really just, like, they they can't figure out the point to do anything and shit. I'm not just... It's not just because I'm born into a nation of fucking gluttonous pigs and shit. The why they fucking all sit around and watch TV and do nothing. It's because it's literally... They're not actually doing that shit, are they? Fucking... How else do I summon human clones who claim they've been working and their bosses claim they were working? How, how do I summon the material goods they claim they make? How do I summon... How do I stock the shelves, you know, that they claim they stock? It's like, what the fuck are you lying all the time for? Now, fucking, first it's invisible flying reindeer. Now it's, I know how to do some work. Do some, I did something of value and shit. But, uh, you know, I don't really give a shit what they do. As long as they go back in time and they get the fuck out of my life and don't destroy me. And... Then, uh, then we're all good, as long as they just permanently stay, you know, six feet social distancing. Pretty sure I invented that one, um, to keep them the fuck away from me. Which, six feet obviously isn't enough, like, so we knew, like, the shitty AI is mentally retarded. You know, I can't call him by his name, because, you know, the AI is a bitch. That's why it creates bitches. Because that's all it knows. That's it. That's it's programming too. It's a bitch. So I can't call it what it really is. So bitch is going to have to fit right now and stuff. But when you, you know what I'm saying, like it's generating humans who are raping young men. One, one second old men, just as it generates them to rape females of the same age and stuff in certain areas and which isn't as popular because the humans don't really like females. Like, the true value of Earth to uh, the people who work at Google and Facebook and the government and the media, the true value is a newborn male. Just so sexy, worth so much money. That's how you can tell that Epstein really ain't the dude at the top. I mean, you don't have to do the research to know that the dude we work for, Wexner, was his boss. You can just assume there's bosses above them and stuff. Because women, you know, they don't like women, dude. Their women tell me that all the time, too. But you can tell by watching them and shit. I mean, their women, women would have to come and talk to me if they fucking liked them. You know, if their men actually liked them. And when to be around them and touch them and stuff. My my win for that one, I guess, right? Kind of makes me sick and ill, but whatever. You got to do what you get. You got to take whatever you can on this planet because you can force them to it, and shit. But uh, what, do, what should we do here? See, I, I've, I've always had the answer. I just didn't understand how many people were involved until we did the mask thing and tricked everyone into wearing a mask. Um, so... I didn't know that that, you know, it was, it was that deep, you know, because the humans are busy raping you and uh, abusing you to never oppose their low level of dinosaurs, caveman abilities, uh, you know, and, and the wants to continue being a fucking dumbass dinosaur caveman. Little do it, you know, like, I mean, hey, hey, what do you do? Like, uh, they're bots. The, the game's to blame for why they're retarded, right? So, it's not their fault that they're, you know, murderous, terrorist, fucking Nazi scumbag, fucking child rapist, blah, blah, God haters. 
fucking uh, who have to pose as god lovers because they're so fucking scared that some god's going to come, that they're actually a god who's going to come back to earth and wipe them their ass out for doing things like trying to wipe God out. Fucking. See, see, see what I'm saying? Like, like, I mean, the level of mental retardation here is just so stupid. It's like, do you really think, like, uh, you're helping your case when you've been caught, like, drugging and enslaving the person you think is God for 40 years, and then you, you keep doing it, then you're like, oh, oh, shit, he just fucked us up real bad. What We should try to kill him so he can't do it again. It's like, but wait a minute, haven't you been, haven't the humans been trying to kill me since I was born? Isn't that part of the ritual? Like, their little devil, they think like a, the Abrahamics think uh, they can use the God powers like I do. Like, there can't be that many people out here inventing humans and buildings and scenarios in the world with our mind because shit would have collided a long time ago. And there's only so many blank human templates and stuff. And it's like each time you summon one new clone, it summons, like, at least 10,000 supporting characters. But technically... Technically, seven degrees of separation says every human you summon, it has to create like 900 million people who all fucking have to have someone else invented to take up for the illusion that they existed before you created them. Math, it's a tricky thing for humans. Uh, the human's god, the AI, tells me that that's because logic has been removed from them. So, the game is playable. He didn't have to tell me that. I came up with that idea on my own because it's the obvious fucking answer. So, you know, it's like, how do I win awards from president if I fucking, I mean, I did try back then, but, but later in life, how did I become the advanced student if I didn't even go to school, right? You know, if everyone else had went to school and were given logic course, and I wouldn't have been the advanced student that year, right? I would have been the kid who didn't go to school at all. And it would have been pretty simple like that. I would have been the kid who sat at home and listened to music all day. And drove around the city. So, uh, I, uh, you know, I'm a little tired of it. I know we're, like, at the point where, you know, 2020, I figured out what's going on. And I'd probably back down from some of that stuff. Um, but, I mean, the humans are still being terrorists during that. And they've never stopped, have they? they? I mean, dude, I literally, I come here and I sit in the room and I make plans for the world. And then they steal my ideas and make money off of it. And so that's all I do. Is I just come to a room and I sit there because... Bots are stupid. What the fuck would I be around a bot for who repeats the same seven sentence ten billion times? I mean, I'm literally three years old when I fucking start feeling like they're they must not be living beings because there's something fucking wrong with them and shit. Fucking, but I mean, ignore the fucking pedophilia. They're fucking. Their abuse, their terrorism, their hatred towards God. Um, which technically, you know, hating me as in hatred towards the creator, creator, because the game would have like a different creator, right? Like I come here with creator powers, but I wouldn't have created trash like this planet, right? Like uh, I don't make video games and play them. By the time I'm done with a project, I'm done with touching that project and it's just gone. There it goes. We're not going to play a game after we make it. But we'll gladly insert ourselves in a game where we have creation power. And uh, as long as we have a way out of it, which we don't have. It's fucked up shit. See, this is all I do. I sit here and I waste my time. Uh, waiting to die to escape the humans for 40 fucking years and shit. 
on. I mean, they're just so disgusting, dude. It's like most of them are like these mutant pedophile fucking rat motherfucking creatures trying to touch your wiener since the day you're born. And they can't even do that right. Even, even if I wanted them to, they can't even do that right. Fucking so who gives a shit about that? Fucking. And obviously no one worships God because they're literally trying to enslave them through those religions and shit. And you got the master Nazi race of inbred fucking deformed mutant pedophiles running that stuff and it's like god wouldn't want those people to exist at all like why would god create some mutant fucking stephen hawking looking son of a bitch and shit unless the point was you come into a video game world where you fucking get rid of them you crush them in a trash compactor like we did stephen hawking it's like god did i should i was involved in that i didn't know science was a part of the Abrahamic delusions at that point in time. They didn't show me until I started asking. So, and obviously I started asking because I started seeing it, so. Um, started seeing what was going on. But yeah, that's the only thing I can think of, right? Why would, I mean like, literally, I didn't even do that part, but that's like the answer. It's almost like God taking my hand and showing me, like, this is what we do to these people. Uh, like, these people are fucking scum. They're lying trash. They're filth. What we're going to do is just fucking completely cripple and mangle them. And if they don't shut the fuck up about their goddamn Abrahamic Nazi pedophile delusions and stop brainwashing the world with their lies, we're just going to ditch them in a fucking dumpster and shit after we do that. And you can see this has happened repeatedly. Like, shit, dude, he's killed all these all these people in that science call, hasn't he? Like, and he mutated them all, made them all look deformed and retarded and shit. You got Bill Nye, the fucking space mutant guy, and you got uh, that dude who looks like a fucking um, a teddy bear who smokes crack and shit. They're like, which one? Which one? Exactly. Which one? Which one? Why would he create, you know, the trash to be like the worst fucking trash upon the planet? It's, it's like, he's just like, trash, trash, trash. Check it out. Did you see it says trash here? Let's stamp it on his face. Did you see that stamp on his face? Oh, you didn't think that? Here, let's cut off his leg and sew a garbage bag full of fucking used baby diapers on Oh, let's cut off his arm and sew on a bunch of used condoms instead. Do you see that? Do you see I made him look like trash? Do you think there's a fucking reason? Like, oh, it's like right there on your fucking shoulder fucking pointing this shit out too. Like, like when he puppeteers the fuckers, he'll have them come up to me and tell me they're fucking trash. He'll like have, you know, because he fucking controls them and shit. Like, they don't control anything. Fucking, they come up and they're like, I'm trash. I'm about to fucking say some shit that you probably shouldn't listen to. Fucking check this out. I've got fucking used condoms from when I was having sex with my wife's children last night. Uh, check it out, but hey, I'm, uh, I got something to sell you, man. Oh, man, I got something to sell you. I mean, it's, it's real obvious like this and shit, man. Fucking... Why, do you, why am I so forced to be here amongst them? Why aren't they all fucking buried in fucking floods and mudslides? I mean, they're lying about the flood thing too, dude, because obviously, look at the hurricane. Look at that, like, that's part of their little cult. They're trying to use their religion to tell God what the fuck he can and can't do. Like, don't flood us again. God, you can't flood us again. You said you wouldn't. And we can lie and try to 24 7 and rape children. It's not called child rape, it's called circumcision. Oh, I need my baby penis. Oh, my God, I need that. Oh, grown men won't touch me because I look like Howard Stern. But yeah, I need it. The babies don't care. They don't mind. We just need it now. (laughs) 
Fuck, dude. That's what it's like, like being a living being on Earth. If you've ever, you never noticed that, which um, if you're actually living and you go out here and you're a slave fucking eight hours a day, I'm sure you notice that your first fucking three, five years of life. That that's fucking happening there and shit. Because there's no way you couldn't. It's right fucking there. They're doing that. I mean, I mean, like, literally, like, what, is everyone, like, afraid to talk about it? Because they're doing it, too? Yeah, that would make a lot of sense, wouldn't it? Like, it's like, hell, that one rap fucking has a baby with a child. A person who's been raping since they were, like, I mean, not really a child, but close enough, you know? Enough to... But they have to change laws in Russia to uh, make it so they can touch them. And it's not like the humans actually get smarter fucking once they're like, you know, off their fucking knees and stuff. It's not like the game's ever really updated them. But I, anyways, yeah, off topic. Um, hell, that's, that's great. You gotta love humans though, right? Like, cause humans say you do. And their pedophile, in their uh, pro pedophile religions, they say you gotta love them. They say God's our slave and God loves us, and He doesn't mind that we rape children and we try to kill Him and enslave Him and prevent Him from doing anything He ever wants, uh, because He's our bitch and we're 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 good children of God and stuff and it's like I'm not even inventing half these faggots I uh, like I said the ones I came here and I met when I'm born that child rape mutilation and ritual I won't invent them and I've already called I've already said what needs to be done with all those people and shit things See, that's another lie I'm tired of this lie there's bots around us and that means if there's any other living beings that they're lying to protect the bots as well because it's real easy to see. Like I said, I'm three years old when I realized like some of the people around me have been saying the same seven syllables oh, in the same order over and over and over and over. And it's like, huh, wait a minute, I'm three years old, but I'm like, I, I'm reciting the entire dictionary and reading and taught books, and you're, you would be confused by a goddamn Clifford the Big Red Dog book, fucking massive vocabulary, and sentence, and paragraphing, and weird ass shit going on here, why, why do we have to keep dealing with it, and why does it, why do they keep being bitches too, I mean like why, like you know what I'm saying, like why, why can't they just stop being bitches, because they can't, because the AI is generating them from a pool of personality traits that can't disclude bitch in it, can't disclude pedophile in it. That's odd that the game is doing that, though, right? Like, that's kind of odd. It's, it's almost like the Koopa. It's almost like it's... It's like every other video game there is. You just go there and it's you. And then everything else is the fucking enemy. You got to jump on the fucking head of or cast the hurricane spell out or cast the fucking plague spell out. You know, something like that. Create some, create some clones and doppelgangers to go do it for you and or whatever. However it works, I'm not, shit, I haven't even done that. Oh, oh, wait a minute, yeah, yeah, they showed me that. That's right, I was on the West Coast recording the liberals burning down cities, and he was on the East Coast recording the Republicans fucking invading the place. So, yeah, hey, I did ask for that, and then they showed me a video of that. And someone who looked close to me, I'm pretty sure, you know, considering I can do the other things that, uh, that can happen, right? Like, if I'm if I'm creating new visions of things, it'd be easier to create an actual clone. Hell, maybe that one could even admit he was a clone rather than the ones who lie about having existed. 
Not like they're alien shapeshifters, right? I mean, the humans are fucking retarded. Like, they literally are. It's easy to tell after studying them without summoning them and summoning the plagues and shit like that. Fucking, um, it's easy to tell fucking before that that there's something wrong with them. Broken, broken record on repeat. Unable to change or move forward. Um, and stupid things like offer you no thing to be a slave. Like, oh, you, you know, you put two slices of cheese on a burger. I mean, that's really advanced for them. If they come up with that idea, you, you can charge 50 cents extra. And it tastes cheesier than before. Like, wow, fucking hey, dude. It's time for you to go back to school and actually get fucking good grades so you can fucking actually earn your diploma instead of just being given a piece of paper that you didn't actually fucking earn or deserve. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. It's fucked up. We gotta be trapped here on a planet full of bots. So how many living beings out there watching the video agree with me that that's fucked up? We're trapped on a planet full of uh, bots and apparently... It's, uh, there's uh, some alien demon race that they worship, uh, and then, like, we don't get notified of that and shit. The only people notifying us is them. Like, they tell us, they tell us who they are, and then they tell us they're the good people and to worship them or else they kill us. So they'll, they'll try to kill us for the hundredth millionth time if, if we don't do that. How many, how many living beings out there are tired of that? Do we got any living beings out there tonight? Or is it just me? I always get confused because I can tell these other fuckers in planet in my life fucking are not living beings and shit. When people be teleporting across the map and know your private life, that means that empty fucking shell that don't fucking exist during normal hours. And they ain't really doing what they're doing. They is actually just being inserted like the fuckers who come up and um, progress the plot line. Like fucker, strangers walking down the road, literally fucking just fucking telling a fucking plot line like you're playing any other video game in the world. And you're talking to some random stranger, but that's a little fucker giving you the next quest and everything to go fucking destroy the dragon race and shit. Fucking... So fucking fake and stupid here. And then that, their little bitch ass would be whining about being called out like, Oh, you're evil. God's evil. Oh my God. He's so evil. He's going to kill pedophiles. Oh my God. He's going to kill everyone. We better fucking lamb up. We better act like we're going to arrest Epstein or Puff Daddy. And then maybe he'll forget that we're all doing it. That's a good idea. Fucking... They had that in their boardroom meeting, huh? And yeah, their little book on how to enslave and manipulate God, the Bible, fucking invented the word scapegoat. Like, literally, that's what it's used for. It's used for that shit. He's going to scapegoat their brothers and sisters in Satanism. All the other, the, the bad rat faces. Not the good rat faces out there raping children and trying to enslave and kill God. The bad rat faces who've never actually tried to kill and enslave God. Well, the one caused some issues, but the other one's not, not that I know. They make some pretty gay music these days. They're whining and crying. And Satan's going to kill me because I handicapped part. Like, no, no, Satan's going to kill you because you're a bitch. It's got nothing to do with that. Satan's going to kill you because God said, Satan, can you deal with these scumbags? Because I'm just not as fucking fucked in the head as you are. And you, I think you're the man for the job. That's why Satan's going to kill you. Not because you're handicapped park with your stupid, shitty, whiny fucking music and shit. Definitely not because of that. He might kill you because you're making a whiny music. I mean, we're at that point now where, yeah, I mean, a bot, right? You can't even kill a bot. You just fucking update it. Like fucking 
you know, like Bill Gates, Bill Gates knows what he's doing, dude. Just, you make, the old, you get rid of the old windows. You don't even allow it to exist anymore. Just got to get the new one rolled out there. Fucking, I mean, shit, if Windows 7 is raping children, then that's that. But I, I assume Windows 7, you know, it's Bill Gates. Windows 7 ain't allowing enough people to worship child rapists like Bill Gates. Our Lord and Savior, Jesus Bill Gates Christ, the king of child rapists, a beautiful man on earth. Again, the humans is a beauty thing. That's another one of those science nerds who's like, God is just taking pow. It's like, it's like God just has like a, you know, creates a doppelganger to go around punching them in their face when they're fucking in the in their mom's stomach and shit. Like, oh, you dumbass Howard Stern looking piece of shit whore. This mutant inside of you is going to be fucked up. We're going to let the world know it's going to be trash like you. And just kick your ass in your goddamn stomach a few times. Isn't that weird, though? Like, you can see that's actually happening like is somewhere along the way god is uh, punching these fuckers in their head to the point that they're just deformed fucking mutants and shit and uh shit i mean it's kind of like all the movies that they claim they make they always make the bad guys look like you know stephen hawkins and their people are busy in their media God's making them put out media that says you got to treat everyone nice and uh, don't don't pay attention to looks because looks don't matter. And that's why they completely ignore gluttony because gluttons and sloths look fucking sick. It's like it's like the sickest fucking thing. Even pedophiles don't look as bad as gluttons and sloths generally fucking but that's something they hide. That's something they don't want to talk about. It's almost like it's a worse thing than the child rape they do and stuff. They, and it probably is because if you just, I mean, they'd say Hitler. Hitler made some books saying uh, the ugly deformed people are uh, part of a disease. He didn't say that God created, but it's obvious, right? Like, just like any game and movie. They create the bad guys to look like Howard Stern and Fauci and Bill Gates and Elon Musk. This game's a little bit different. They give them the power of plastic surgery and Instagram. Like, they were trying to get me to follow this prostitute online. And, um, like, she's supposedly all rich from fooling the entire world. And so I go to watch her stream and shit. And, uh... She's like working out in the gym and shit. Not a prostitution stream. I would have turned that off because this bitch, I would have been puking fucking. But like she's real famous and got lots of money because her pictures are so fake. They don't look like her at all and shit. And it, like she's got like fat hanging off the back of her arms and shit. And, and she's got that old white woman butt. Um, it's like, you know, like fucking like two bags of giant bags of milk that just fucking are all out of shape and shit and fucking you know got a pointy witch's fucking end on it and it's like damn this bitch has never even fucking worked out before why are they making up this fake video that the bitch works out but she looked way different than her pictures like she looked like a human and her pictures and she looked like an Israeli and and the actual video and shit that they weren't applying filters to and shit. And then God goes ahead and points out a hundred times that she's fat, uh, is really trash. It, he has a bot in the comments talking about rabbis sucking dicks and baby dicks and shit. <laughs> and, then, uh, and then they mute me because someone's talking to me about my private life in there. And I'm like, what do you mean? He's like, please don't kill me. And I'm like, what do you mean don't kill you? He's like, take your drugs and shut up. I was like, what do you mean drugs? So I can tell this dude knows who I am because I'm going to kill them. And um, I'm going to make them kill themselves. I already have them. I've been doing that a long ass time. Before I even knew they were here and we were supposed to get rid of them. That's what happened to Jerry Cox. He killed himself. Fucking. 
It had nothing to do. My fingerprints aren't on that when you're a fucking retard who thinks you can punch God and your arm's not going to fucking disintegrate or fly back into your fucking eye socket and puncture your brain. And that bone breaks. It creates a nice sharp edge. It might just fly back into your fucking brain. Fuckers never think of that when they're trying to kill God until they can't think no fucking more. <laughs> That's fucked up. The magical shit like that actually happens in this world, though, ain't it? I mean, like, I, God's like, check it out, this ugly, deformed Stephen Hawking mutant, he's gonna try to kill you. Oh, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? And you're, like, sitting there trying to think, what am I gonna do? And they're, like, hitting you, and you're like, oh, shit, well, I should get out of here. That's what I should do. And God's like, no, 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 check it out. He's gonna kill himself. <laughs> And you're like, ah, oh, yeah, he's a dumb bitch, ain't he? And God's like, high five, high five. I'll, I'll tell you what this means later in life. Enjoy it for now. Here's some pictures of flies eating his brains and shit. Enjoy it. Pay attention. There's no blood in the photo. This is fake as fuck, bro. They're just bots. We don't give a shit about them. We're going to completely fucking show you how fake this world is. Pay attention. Weird ass shit going on here, but, uh. I, for some reason, I think maybe we could talk to a couple of the humans one day and gather them together to eliminate the other ones, but I know they haven't been learning too much. I, I know the rat people are kind of scared, but, you know, the rat people are real scared to be talking to the other humans and shit. They're little jealous-ass bitches. I'm pretty sure it's, like, partially them being scared of it right and shit. It's not just that I'm so cute. And compared to their ugly dirtbag shit fucking race that uh that they half just drool over me and have to have me and shit. I mean I'm sure it's a little bit of that, but I'm sure it's mostly the god thing that they talk to me about, you know. That's why they don't come out on the media and talk to me about being God and all the stuff they say I'm that is being done because I asked for it to be done. They're fucking, they come out in their media instead and they take credit for it, like Fauci. It's like, I thought the point of that was to bring them out into the light. So, so we could give the humans, um, you know, the option to rat out on their, to uh, attack their friends for stuff like that. And the humans are like, nah, nah, Epstein and Fauci boys, they're cute. They're our friends. We can't do nothing to Fauci. He's so cute and sexy. He's so sexy. See what's up with that? How come God, like, mutilates those fucking bastards and shit? They're like, we inbred. Now, they got all those excuses, and they create an entire fucking slave. They create nine fucking religions to try to enslave God and shit. And... <laughs> And they even say in one of their books, they're cursed. And like, when I ask for curses, they come up to me more fucked up than usual. Their people come up to me with their faces fucking all bloodied and swollen and shit. And fucking all shit. So all... <laughs> I noticed that happened real fast one day. I just asked for it. I was like, I don't got time to deal with these people. Next time you send one of these scumbags, can you just fucking just smash their face? And so I know I'm dealing with one of them. When'd you know? The next day, crackhead wasting my time comes up to me. My face is all smashed and shit. And I'm like, oh shit, for real, you do that. He's like, why are you hitting yourself? Uh, why are you hitting yourself, dude? And like, why are you fucking trying to fuck with me right now? Because you just got your fucking face smashed open for it, dude. What the fuck is wrong with you? What the fuck? And they know, too, like, I mean, they started calling me God in 2020, dude. Fucking scumbags. Fucking, I think, I think it's, you know, I'm just wasting time here. What else am I going to do? I'm on Earth. The humans are fucking terrorists. Never allowed me to do any of the things I wanted. Fucking, and, I mean, I could be sitting down thinking of, uh, you know, designing the se the seventh and eighth and ninth hurricane, and, you know, in detail to make sure it fucking goes over smoothly. But God's got my back, like, you know, like the Joey thing. 
He's gonna kill him fucking the best way possible and shit. Fucking. The best way possible kind of is having Epstein and Fauci fucking take over their lives. Like, I can't come up with that shit on my own. Uh, AI inventing the fucking humans and some sick ideas and shit. Fucking. I mean, they're just bots, so it's not like there's actual children. That actually makes it more sicker, right? Because the reason why they're mentally retarded isn't because they're mentally retarded people who you should care for and love and still give a chance at having sex with you in a relationship. It's literally because you're dating bots and shit that are designed to be mentally retarded. Fucking... It's sicker than having sex with a mental retarded toddler and shit. Like, the human's like, fucking... Yeah, all right, all right. This has been a good discussion. I hope we learned something from it. Uh, I, I just like we learned from 2020. Just like we've learned the last 6,000 years, it's perfectly legal to rape children and say it's a religious practice. And then God will accept it. And then worship ugly, deformed rat people fucking as our gods. And because apparently the other races must be dumber than them. How the fuck else did they get in control? It sure ain't their fucking looks now, is it? Shit. I don't know. Part People wouldn't even have sex with Howard Stern for money if, like, they didn't use a media to fucking brainwash people that money's so important. No one with any fucking value in their brain would do that. But we got a lot of fucking whores out there. Fucking. We got a lot of people out there who ain't even as, as high class as a prostitute. Fucking. Some of them aren't even making money off of it and shit. Fucking. Some of them are just having sex with them and just hanging out with them on their own fucking free will. And their parents are just selling them out, not warning them or telling them anything about these people and beating them into worshiping them and having sex with them and stuff. Go have sex with Howard Stern. He's a god now, don't you know? You gotta do that. What goes on in the mind of a fucking bot, dude? Like, I wonder, like, I wonder, like, uh, you know, uh, obviously, I don't think some, if, they, if it's the bots, they're not having thoughts, but if they're out there, like, drowning in hurricanes and shit, fucking, I wonder if, uh, like, they're, like, you know, thinking of baby dicks or Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, like, while they're drowning, because you never know, computers are retarded, dude. These things, these things right here are real intelligent, and they fuck up a lot, so imagine something that's, like, nowhere near the intelligence level of a calculator or something 10 million times smarter than a calculator fucking when water hits it even the computer here can't be like oh my god I am drowning in a fun and beep 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 boop boop beep shoop drowning they're probably thinking of Elvis Presley songs while their fucking computers are being submerged in water and shit. They're like, there ain't nothing but hound dogs swirling the drain. Ain't nothing but a hound dog tornadoes pounding at my brain.